So here we have the Ford Transit Custom on a 70 plate. I'm going to start off by showing you inside the rear of the van and then we'll hop in and run through some controls from there. As we approach the back of the van, you'll see we have reversing sensors, plenty of space as well. It's all been ply lined. We have that full metal bulkhead and side sliding door access as well. Okay, now that we're inside the van, we're going to start with the dials. On the left-hand side, we have the rev counter. On the right-hand side, the speedometer. The fuel gauge and coolant temperature gauges are at the bottom in the middle. And then above that, we have the uh, main trip computer, which includes the total miles of the van. They are 10,134. We have a digital readout for the speedometer above that. You can change information that's displayed in that section using a button on the steering wheel. The button in question is just here. We have stereo and phone controls beneath that. Stereo controls continue on the left along with cruise control and speed limiter. You'll only be able to use the phone controls after such time as the phone is paired up to the vehicle, which is done by hitting pair device. Search for Ford Transit on your device and select Ford Transit once it is found. Just follow the instructions on screen from there. When it comes to audio in this van, we have AM, FM and DAB radio, as well as Bluetooth audio, so you can stream your music wirelessly. We have the main volume for the stereo just there. Beneath that, we've got the air conditioning. So you can turn the system on and adjust the fan speed from here. The temperature is adjustable just there. Direction of the air. And then hit that button to turn your air conditioning on or off again, of course. Uh, you can recirculate the air that's in the van. That's a great way of heating up or cooling it down quickly, depending on the temperature you've set just here. We have a heated front screen and heated mirrors, heated driver's seat and a passenger seat as well both with three different heat settings each. We back out, we've got a six speed manual gearbox, 12 volt charging socket over here with a USB uh, input next to it. That is duplicated up in front of the driver's steering wheel just there. All that leaves me to say is thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you'd like to come and see the van in person and have a test drive, please feel free to call any of our MJA sites. We'd love to hear from you soon.